Hey yo, the Flying Halucha here. I thought I'd go back to my old roots of uh, hey yo, this is NKR, the Plocon Collector, but you know, <laughs> what do you prefer? Hey everyone, or hey yo, <laughs> as I used to do. I don't know, either one will, will do. But uh, yeah, this came. Uh, I really wanted to get it, but I think at the time it was like £20 for part one, £20 for part two. I was like, I don't want to pay like £40 for a series that only is like. Was it 13 episodes? Yeah. But uh, this is... Uh, the only reason that I wanted to get this is it's from the same studio that made Karanoki Eye, a.k.a. The Garden of Sinners, and Fate. God Eater is made by a studio, Ufo Table. Uh, Ufo Table or Ufo Table or... <laughs> Ufo Table. <laughs> I think Ufo Table sounds better. Ufo Table. Uh, Ufo Table. No, I kind of like Ufo Table better. I call it that for now. But yeah, Studio Euphro Table was the one that animated this. So it's going to look excellent. Uh, I love Euphro Table. It's one of my favourite animation studios. Uh, let's see. Look how cool that animation looks. They also made that... Uh, that flipping... What's the guy's name? Oh, look. They've made an error mistake there. Audio PMC, I think that's supposed to mean PCM. I actually googled that, uh, what PCM is. I would have preferred DTS HD Master, but PCM, I think... I can't explain it. I think it's supposed to adapt to your fucking TV or some shit. PMC. <laughs> it's supposed to be PCM, but never mind, I don't really care about little fucking... They'll figure that out, and then the next ones, they'll just correct that little mistake. But, uh, yeah, unlike the other MVM Entertainment releases, I think I got this for, like, £22 or something. Uh, yeah, they sold it in parts, parts one and parts two. America didn't go all out on this. I think it's actually... I don't know if America have this or not. I don't know if they have it on Blu-ray or not. I think they might. They might not. It's not an anime that America are very accustomed to when it comes to, you know, Blu-ray and home video release, but... Yeah, this is literally just released. I'm one of the first people to unbox this. Well, it's one of the first... Yeah, you're never going to find a collector's edition of this, unfortunately. Even America doesn't have one, but... Just take the set of aim off. Give me a second. Okay, so look at that, look at that artwork. But yeah, instead of buying it in two parts, I got it as a complete series, which MVM announced in November. And then they said it would be arrive in January, but thankfully I got it in December, which is excellent. But, uh, here it goes. Animation produ production UFO table. There we go. And yeah, we're going to open it up. Meh. Oh, yeah, there we go. Never mind. Uh, there you go. Really nice discs, I like them. MVM don't usually make nice discs, but they're no exception. 13. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there's also a prologue, which I think it's... Yeah, there's a, I think there's there's a prologue, uh, which I think you can just watch on YouTube. And there's also something else. Uh... uh I don't know, uh, but when I went on my anime list, yeah, it's got it, it was literally that, that's it. But then you got some prologue, and then I think you got some, like, little special thing, I think it's like a trailer for the film or something, not the film, the game, because this is based off the game. But, uh, yeah, you got the prologue, which unfortunately was never included. Uh, was it even in English? I'm not sure it was. It might be, I could be mistaken. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, Prologue is not included, unfortunately. Big shame. Uh, clean, opening, and closing. That PMC is really bugging me. Because uh, I... Let me go to my collection real quick. i got a crap ton of anime that I just haven't put away. See... <laughs> see anything you like. It's quite dark in the room, so you won't be able to see all of them. You've already seen my psycho passes. That's all my fate all stacked up on one another. 
Uh, I will be doing an unboxing of Camus and Kings. I'm waiting for season one at the moment to come through my letterbox. <laughs> it has not come yet. But, uh, God, I'm going to have to take my lane down. Uh, my Captain Earth, which I've already done an unboxing of. My notebook, I'm going to fall. Already done an unboxing of. There we are. Yeah, I knew they made a mistake. Look. See? PCM. I will do an unboxing of Familiar Zero just when I get season two. But for now, no. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they made a mistake there, which is PMC instead of PCM. Uh, let me just put that back on there. Was that up there? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. And then, see, you can't see it all. It's very dark because I'm actually blocking the light. But screw it. You know, I've already unboxed most of these anyway. Every single one of these I've unboxed, apart from Familiar Zero. But anyway, we are going off track. We are going off track here. We are going off track. But, uh... Yeah. Just released today. Instead of getting in two parts, I got his nice, complete collection. I don't think anywhere else is that... Uh, any other country. Maybe Australia. I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if any other country, maybe Japan, of course, have brought out a complete collection. I think MVM is selling it for, like, £28 now. Which is kind of confusing, as they're selling both parts, in uh, one and part two. Yeah, they're selling part one and part two for, like, £20 each, but a complete series for, like, 29 or some shit. It makes no sense, does it? But, yeah... Just came today, supposed to come in January, but it came early, which is excellent. Here's a bit of the information. Hopefully one day I get all of you for table, but some of their older uh, older works aren't that memorable. You know, they had like sh some Sharknado ripoff, but it was uh, actually an uh, adaptation of one of Jinji Ito's manga. <laughs> it was some shark that was running on four legs and shit, but... Can't remember when that's cool, but yeah. Anyway, uh, I hope to see you all in the next unboxing. Flying Halucha. Shit, bye bye. Oh, before I go, yeah, I'll just leave like uh, in my comment section and I'll pin it. Uh, you know, I haven't done too much research, but on the prologue or the special features that the God Eater anime has. Not the special features, what I meant to say. Uh, it just has two other things that you can watch as well, but they're not essential, but. One promotes the game, and, yeah. But anyway, I'll leave you maybe a description or a comment, most likely a comment. But yeah, hope to see you all very soon. Flying Kalucha, bye-bye.